Imagine diving into an online experiment only to stumble upon a digital battleground, a hidden world of cyber espionage that's shaping the future of global power. This is the story of Operation Shady Rat, an intricate web of digital theft and espionage that catapulted China into the spotlight as a superpower. What secrets lie within the virtual walls of a decoy water plant? How did this discovery redefine global cybersecurity and power dynamics? In December 2012, cybersecurity researcher Kyle Wilhoit embarked on an intriguing experiment that would inadvertently expose a monumental cyber espionage campaign. By creating a virtual water plant equipped with sophisticated industrial control systems, Wilhoit simulated a fully operational facility based in Arnold, Missouri. However, this plant existed only in the digital realm, operated from the confines of his basement. The goal? To observe the tactics of potential cyber attackers. Within days, the virtual plant attracted attention from a myriad of threats, including North Korean military hackers, Russian ransomware gangs, and various trolls. Amidst these attacks, one stood out, a series of well-crafted phishing emails containing malware that once launched began transmitting detailed plant data to a remote server in China. Wilhoit had stumbled upon APT1, a notorious hacker group behind Operation Shady Rat. Similar cyber intrusions had been occurring globally for years, targeting not virtual entities, but real companies and government institutions. After Kyle Wilhoit's surprising discovery, the world started to pay more attention to the shadows of the internet, where silent wars are fought. Operation Shady Rat was a wake-up call, showing that spies didn't need to sneak into offices anymore. They could steal secrets from anywhere in the world with just a few clicks. This operation wasn't a one-time event. It had been quietly happening for years, targeting industries and governments across the globe. The attackers were smart, using tricks to get into computer networks without anyone noticing. They were after anything valuable, secret designs, business plans, and even emails from top executives. What made Operation Shady Rat remarkable wasn't just its size or the secrets it stole. It was how it showed that the digital space could be a battleground for power. Countries and companies had to wake up to a new reality where keeping secrets safe meant more than just locking a file cabinet. It meant securing every piece of data in the digital world. The exposure of Operation Shady Rat marked a turning point in how the world viewed cybersecurity and espionage. With the involvement of McAfee and later Mandiant's reports, it became clear that the operation was linked to Unit 61398 of the People's Liberation Army of China. Countries and corporations around the world were forced to acknowledge that their most valuable assets, their intellectual properties, and sensitive information were under constant threat. Industries from defense to technology and even governmental agencies had been penetrated, leaving a trail of intellectual theft that had, until then, been unparalleled. As the world grappled with the implications of Operation Shady Rat, the focus shifted to the consequences of such widespread cybercrime. The operation had siphoned off an enormous volume of intellectual property, from cutting-edge technological designs to confidential government communications. This was about gaining a competitive edge in global politics and economics. The fallout was significant. High-profile targets, including defense contractors like Lockheed Martin, found themselves compromised with potential impacts on national security and the global balance of power. The revelation that such a comprehensive and prolonged campaign had been orchestrated by a state actor underscored the urgent need for robust cybersecurity measures. In the aftermath of Operation Shady Rat's exposure, there was a significant shift in how cybersecurity was approached globally. The realization that a state-sponsored entity could orchestrate such a far-reaching and sophisticated campaign prompted a re-evaluation of defensive strategies. Countries and corporations alike began to invest heavily in cybersecurity, recognizing the need for advanced protections against increasingly sophisticated threats. The evolution didn't stop with bolstered defenses. The nature of cyber operations themselves began to change. China, in particular, refined its tactics, moving away from the broad sweeping campaigns of the past to more targeted and stealthy operations. This transition marked a new era in cyber espionage, where the emphasis was on precision and avoiding detection, reflecting a maturation of capabilities and strategies. This operation opened the world's eyes to the profound implications of cyber warfare and the critical need for resilient digital defenses. As we've seen, 
The ripple effects of these cyber operations extend far beyond the immediate theft of information, challenging our notions of security, privacy, and international diplomacy. Today, the legacy of Operation Shady Rat continues to influence cybersecurity policies and practices worldwide. The battle for information supremacy is ongoing, with nations and corporations constantly seeking to outmaneuver each other in a high-stakes online war. Are you ready for the next attack? Will you be the next victim, or will you act on it?